Hello, I'm Leon Yoder. Uh, I'm a pinstriper and sign painter. And uh, here in Shipshawana, been pinstriping for um, I don't know how many years uh, since 13. I'm 40, 40 years old now. So my uh, brother started uh, doing restoration work on carriages, and um, uh, I was helping at a young age. We had a farm repair shop, and uh, my uh, grandfather or my great uncle had a blacksmith shop that my dad took over so we did some blacksmithing and uh, farm repair and then my brother got into uh, uh, restoring antique carriages and and uh, I helped with that and got to learn the the woodworking trade and the wheelwright trade and and uh, different aspects of it and uh, and then he started doing some pinstriping and I saw that and I thought I'd like to try my hand at that so uh, didn't know a whole lot about it I started using a, a bugler striper which is a, a steel tube with a roller at the end that you put your paint in and, and you use that to roll on the stripes I did a little research and uh, yeah. reading old carriage uh, trade magazines and such I discovered that um, uh, they use brushes um, to do the pinstriping so I talked to a local sign painter, which uh, turned out to be my mentor long term. Uh, he got me started in the sign business uh, quite a few years later, but um, um, he uh, he told me what brushes to use. He wasn't really a pinstriper himself, but he knew what was used, and uh, um, so he showed me, uh, gave me actually a couple brushes. They were Mac, uh, uh, made by Andrew Mac. They're called sword brush. Uh, they're shaped as a little sword, and uh, they're they're not cut to this shape, but rather the hairs are shaped to this um, design. It holds a lot of paint, and you can uh, pull a real fine line, or as you push down on it, why well, you can get a wider line. And uh, so I started practicing with this. Um, uh, round 13 and um, I ended up uh, the more I did uh, I slowly ended up getting a little better at it and uh, so many years later I they're still building carriages now here I it's at Troyer Carriage Company and uh, um, I used to work for them as well for a while but uh, now I have my own sign company uh, I just come in and do the pinstriping for them and